what's up I hate snow just released snow breeze 2.5.1 and this has all these changes here you can read these with the link in the description main thing is that it works with animated boot logos and like before it has multitasking gestures I'm gonna be showing you how to get multitasking gestures and animated boot logos on your iDevice everything but the iPad 2 for version firmware version 4.3.1 so what you're gonna need to do first off before you do this is jailbreak using um, using snow breeze we have a video we posted a few days ago here's a post on our site this will uh, show you how to do it the only difference is you're gonna be using version 2.5.1 and in our post we have uploaded we have updated the d the download link to the 2.5.1 version and there'll be only two little differences I'll be showing you right now the first one is you're going to have to check um, the general settings or whatever and then hit the green or the blue arrow um, on the bottom right and then showed in this next picture you're going to make sure that these two things are checked before you continue with the build of the firmware. Now once you do that just follow the rest of that video and this post all the stuff you need will be in this post and once you um, uh, restore your device like in the video and your jailbroken on 4.3.1 I'm going to now show you how to get animated boot logos and uh, enable multitasking gestures so I'll switch over to the iPod right now okay guys so here's my freshly jailbroken iPod touch fourth generation and I'm going to be showing you first how to enable the multitasking gestures just go into your settings app go to general and scroll down and you'll see this thing says multitasking gestures just pop that on and then your gestures should work you can see you do like four fingers up to make that little thing go you can squeeze out of apps like so it's a little hard on a small screen but uh, a lot of people like it so I definitely wanted to demo that off now the second thing is how to get the animated boot logo working I'm going to show you how to get animated boot logos all you have to do is go to Cydia and search sorry guys once this loads I can show you um, Apple boot logo now you're going to just have to install this by clicking on it then do modify and right here will be install I already have installed so I'll show you what that looks like now, no app will pop up once you install it. You'll have to reboot your device. When you reboot your device, it should look pretty normal. But in settings app, you'll get this thing that looks like this. It has boot logo. And you can select your boot logo. So, also you can download tons of the boot logos in the section for add-ons, boot logos. A lot of people made some that look pretty neat. And we have um, the built-in logo. And I uh, have one called uh, Skull Me Awesome iPod. So I'll be uh, showing that off, showing that it actually works. See, I have it checked right there, and I'm on 4.3.1 because I have these cool gestures. So we're going to be powering off the device. I don't have SP settings, so I'll have to do it the slow way. And showing you what this that it actually does work, and um, previewing it right now. So we'll be turning it on, and you won't see it immediately, but you'll see the Apple logo showing right there and in a few seconds it will continue so there we go we have the animated boot logo it runs slowly because it only runs at a few frames per second because that's what it all can take this happens when you boot up your iPod, iPhone, iPad so I thought this was pretty cool and I spent a long time making this video so if you can give it a thumbs up that would be great subscribe for more videos and I'll see you in another um video.